to a document which was above all else a document not of rhetoric but of own decision. It set forth their grievances with eloquence, but such eloquence had been heard before. But what distinguished this paper from all the others was the final irrevocable decision that it took to assert the independence of free states in place of colonies and to commit to that goal their lives, their fortune, and their sacred honor. That declaration, whose yellowing parchment and fading, almost illegible lines, is still a revolutionary document. To read it today is to hear a trumpet call for that declaration unleashed. Not merely a revolution against the British, but a revolution in human affairs. Its authors were highly conscious of its worldwide implications. And George Washington declared that liberty and self-government were, in his words, finally staked on the experiment entrusted to the hands of the American people. This prophecy has been borne out, and it remains the most powerful force anywhere in the world today. Not the individual liberty of one, but the indivisible liberty of all.